The Minister of State for Health, Honorable Joseph Ikuman Kama, has commissioned the permanent site of the Azikiwe University Teaching Hospital, Newi, Newi North Local Government Area, Anambra State. Commissioning the hospital, Honorable Ikuman Kama expressed delight to the massive works already done in the permanent site and noted that the hospital stands out among the ones they have visited since it assumed office. Health correspondent Chibuzo Koye completes the report. The minister explained that President Mohamed Buhari gave them the mandate to ensure that every Nigerian receives best medical care, which was why he signed into law the National Health Act, which stipulates, among other things, that every Nigerian will receive free medical care to the tune of 250,000 naira yearly. Honorable Ekumakama made it clear that the hospital is the realization of the vision of the president, whose dream is to see effective budget utilization of every ministry, especially the health ministry and thanked Newi community for their support for a seamless execution of the projects in the hospital. I feel that you do everything humanly possible to ensure that you render the best health services you can give to patients who will come from far and near to receive medical treatment from this hospital and also to ensure the sustenance and maintenance of this beautiful edifice. The governor of Anambra State, Professor Chuku Maseludo, represented by the Anambra State Commissioner for Health, Dr. Afamo Bidike, thanked President Buhari for the conversion of Onesha General Hospital to a federal medical center, the great work he did at Nayut Permanent Site in, at the Second Niger Bridge, Onesha. Governor Saludo said that his administration is committed to reversing medical tourism in the state, which is in tandem with what is seen in Nayut Permanent Site, and said that he has already awarded the contract for access road to the hospital Hospital, to reduce the stress people may go through in visiting the hospital. We, the governor is so much happy. I said you should please thank the president for the support he's giving to the people of Alabama State. Thank you so much. Thank you. The senior special assistant to President Buhari on sustainable development goals, Mrs. Adejo Kadefliwe, maintained that the Nayut permanent site is among many healthcare facilities built by the Buhari administration in all the 36 states in Nigeria and hoped that the incoming administration will sustain the project to achieve prosperity by providing basic healthcare services to Nigerians. Earlier, the chief medical director of Namdazikiwe University Teaching Hospital, Newi, Dr. Joseph Ubaja, who was highly elected, said, that it is an honor for him and that their vision is to be one of the third best hospitals in West Africa and to transform Nayut into a medical mega city. Dr. Ubaja said that they have projects done by the SDG's office and others executed through the support from the Federal Ministry of Health in the hospital. Some of the dignitaries that attended the event were the Director General Budget Office Nigeria, Mr. Ben Akabweze, former Governor of Anambra State, Dem Veji Etiaba, an oil magnet engineer at Eze, represented by his brother, Dr. Emekeze, Chief Innocent Chuoma of Innocent Motors, Igwe Emekilun of Iftedunu, the Managing Director and Chief Executive Officer of Anambra State medical oxygen plant, Mrs. Wamaka Arize, among numerous stakeholders. The minister, CMD, and other dignitaries had earlier paid courtesy call on the traditional rule of Newi Igwekenet Orizu. The event also featured the groundbreaking of proposed Igwe Orizu International ICT Center, while some of the projects commissioned were Diagnostic Center, Pediatric Emergency Center, Medical Ward Complex, Molecular Laboratory, Modern Child Complex, among others. From Namdi Azikiwa University Teaching Hospital, Newi. This is Chibuzo Koye for ABS News.